now. As the Omicron variant continues to spread, the Associated Press is reporting more people are calling in sick, unable to work. And while that's happening, the CDC is also reducing the amount of days that people should isolate when they've been diagnosed with COVID. It went from 10 days to five after the CDC says that people are no longer contagious. Jesse DeGuiato talked to an expert at University Health who provides some clarification on what to do during isolation. If you've tested positive, regardless of your vaccination status, the CDC now says isolate for just five days instead of 10. And if you have no symptoms or the symptoms improve after five days, CDC says you no longer need to isolate and should wear a mask for five days. But if you have a fever, CDC says stay home until it's gone. You really need to be wearing a mask irrespective of your isolation or quarantine period. Dr. Alsip with University Health says CDC's data was based on the rate of transmission from person to person in the first few days of infection, not the lab data. But that would be more reassuring because we would know exactly whether something can replicate and transmit after five days or not to give you, a, I think, a, a greater sense of comfort. If you're not boosted or unvaccinated and exposed to someone who tests positive, CDC recommends isolating for five days and wearing a mask for five days. If you can't quarantine, wear a mask for 10 days and get tested on day five. Based on the data that they're uh, seeing, they feel pretty comfortable. That's, um, those are good recommendations. Confusing though the changing guidelines may be, he says the simplest advice is to get vaccinated and boosted. I think that's really important to be aware of, irrespective of some of the changing dates and times. Jesse DeGollado, KSAT 12 News.